So this is going to be a quick video on going full pipe wire on Ubuntu 22.04 and family. I'm going to do this three times. Do it once in Ubuntu, once in Lubuntu, and once in Kubuntu. The commands will be the same. Should all work the same. And it's it's a little disappointing that Ubuntu didn't go full pipe wire to begin with because they they almost did. It, it's already running in the background. In fact, if we do an apt search pipe wire, you will see there's a lot of things already installed for pipe wire. Gnome, uh, gnome remote desktop, GStream, and gnome. It's a it's a, a dependency in gnome, as far as I know. The first four things, all the way down to Lib Pipewire Common, and then Pipewire Modules. Quite a few things, all the way down through here. Even Pipewire itself. Pipewire itself is installed automatic. Why is it not the default server? So we're going to make it the default server, and it's actually really easy to do. In fact, let's do a real quick the uh, command PACTL. That's uh, Pulse Audio Controller Info, I think. Info. That will show you right here, server name, Pulse Audio. Right now we are running Pulse Audio for our audio server, and we are going to change that. It's actually quite easy. I'm gonna install a few packages to help the rest of uh, PipeWire along. sudo apt install PipeWire. PipeWire audio client libraries. Pipewire hyphen audio hyphen client hyphen libraries space lib spa hyphen 0 0.2 hyphen Bluetooth space lib spa hyphen 0 0.2 hyphen jack wire plumber And this should, by default, want to remove Pipewire Media Session. That is a good thing. We want Pipewire Media Session to be removed because Wire Plumber is a replacement for Pipewire Media Session. So everything in here looks good. Let me hit yes. And finally, we're going to do system CTL tac tac user space tac tac now enable wire plumber dot service. So now we're going to reboot. So just reboot. We are now rebooting. I'm going to fire up terminal again. Going to rerun our Actal Info, and right there is what you want to see, Pulse Audio on Pipewire. It is installed and working. It is no longer running on Pulse. Going to load up a web page with some audio, make sure it's working. Out here. So and I have audio. Audio is now running from Pipewire. Unable to retain all of the rainfall. I'm gonna, so you could see some I'm gonna fire up a Kubuntu instance and we'll do it again. Sitting nice and comfy in the low 70s. But this is Kubuntu 22.04. We're going to go ahead and go full Pipewire with this with the same exact commands. So second time, sudo apt install Pipewire audio client libraries space lib spa hyphen zero point two hyphen bluetooth space lib spa hyphen zero point two hyphen Jack and wire plumber should
it should remove pipe wire media session which it is yes we definitely want that and i forgot to mention it in the ubuntu one so i'll mention it here if you need bluetooth also do sudo apt remove pulse audio module bluetooth Now do system CTL, tac tac user, space, tac tac. Now, enable. Oh goodness, enable. Wire plumber dot service. Now do a reboot. So now we're going to go back into console, do a quick PACTL space info. We have Pulse Audio on Pipewire, exactly what we want. I'm going to fire up a Lubuntu session and we'll do it one more time just to make sure it works in that one. Okay, so this is Lubuntu 22.04. We're going to start this one off with a PACTL info. And you see Pulse Audio is running. Let's go ahead and go to our commands. Sudo apt install. Pipewire. Audio. Client. Libraries. Space. LibSPA. Hyphen. 0.2. Hyphen Bluetooth. LibSPA. Hyphen. 0 dot 2 hyphen deck and wire plumber yes that is exactly what we want now system ctl tac tac user tac tac now Enable wire plumber dot service reboot we will go back into system tools Q terminal B A C T L info Pulse audio on pipe wire is exactly what you want it to say. So if you like what I do here Please like and subscribe and make an old truck driver happy. Until next time, thanks for watching.